All right, so welcome to our Bratcher home. Hi, my name is Melissa Bratcher and I want to welcome you to our house tour. If it's your very first time, go ahead and hit the like button and make sure you subscribe. Don't forget to hit the bell so you can get all of our notifications. All right, so here is my front porch. I absolutely love it. One of the features of the home, we added two white rocking chairs and some pillows that I made. I took two placemats, glued them together, put some stuffing in between them, and there you have it, some black and white farmhouse look pillows. I also have one extra one that was left, so I just placed it on our table here that we spray painted. It was an old wooden table. I just spray painted it white, added a mat, and this farmhouse look little house fixture here. And we have our candles that we burn to keep the bugs away. Absolutely love this space. I'm outside, but I'm also covered, so if it's raining or anything like that, we can sit out here and enjoy the weather. But you'll be there ready to rescue me if i go out of track you can get away with it you all right so come on in my imperfections answer all my questions all right here we have our humble home we love it it took us a while to find something that we all agreed on and that was big enough and had enough space and we feel like this was the perfect home Right here when you first walk in, it should have been a dining room area, but I turned it into a living room area because we didn't really have somewhere where we all could sit down and watch TV as a family. So we just kind of improvised and I bought this sofa at Rooms To Go. I absolutely love it. I was looking for something denim and they had the perfect set and I added the yellow pillows to accent it here. I found this rug here at Lowe's, absolutely loved it. Found it right after I got out of the hospital from having my son, and I absolutely love it. Here we have our TV mounted on the wall, and it actually turns different colors, so right now it looks like it's on purple, but we can change it out to different colors and things like that. So, yeah, it's nice and cozy. Faded in this dark and smoky room Way your face reflecting bright green, bright and blues. You know I kinda want to disappear with you, but I don't. All right, so here's where all the magic happens. Here, this is where my daughter Shania does all the editing. She does such a wonderful job. We found this chair at Walmart. It is so cute and it's lightweight, but it's very stylish and modern. It's the colors that I needed. We liked it so much, we purchased two more. China has one, and Shania has one in her room as well. So we call this like our little media room where we come, get on our phones, read the Bible, talk, chit chat, whatever. So we found these tables here at Bitlocks, you know, my favorite store. Got them there. They're actually outdoor tables, but I was looking for a short and a tall table. They ran out of stock for the ones that I wanted, so we found these and they were perfect for the area. We already had this sofa from our other house. We just brought it here and used it. Got some accent pillows. I was going with the black and white mustard green thing. Found this rug at Target. Absolutely love it. Black and white is actually one of my favorite colors, so we had to spruce that up with this area of black and white. I had some old stickers. I don't know even remember where I got them from, but I had them sitting around and I thought, hmm, let me make this accentable over here and put some black and white on my fireplace and actually fit perfect in there. This I brought from my other house. As for me and my house, we will serve the Lord. Found this at TJ Maxx, so cute. It's a bird with a crown on it. Very fitting for the farmhouse look that we have going on here. Found this, we actually light up a tea light so it makes it look like it's lit up at night. It's so cute. We got a B, of course, for Bratcher. Placed it there. Home, we love home, we love family. And I decided to place a reef up there because it kind of looked like a house trimming up there. So we added a reef to make it look like it's outdoors. So just perfect for the farm look theme. Here 
I made this. There's beauty in my brokenness. You know, when you're a Christian, you go through some things, but God will replace and make you better. So that's why I printed this out, placed it in a Dollar Tree frame and made it a picture. Found this cute piece at a garage sale. Absolutely love it. The arrows. I absolutely love about this house, the double doors that lead us outside to my second porch, which is an outdoor porch as well, but it's screened in. So this was one of my favorite highlights of the house as well, because I like to be outside, but not technically outside. We grabbed up two chairs from Lowe's. We had to get two of the same ones because we have a large family. So one little one and a big one wouldn't have worked. So we decided to get two of the same kind. We found these pillows, threw them on here, accented it very well. The rug here is from Lowe's as well. It is an outdoor rug, gray and white, different patterns. I loved it. It just went with the white outside. We had a ceiling fan placed out here so we could sit out here and be cool and still be outside and enjoying the outside breeze. And we also had a TV mounted out here. So whenever we wanna come out here and dine and talk together, we can still watch TV. Now outside here, we have our swimming pool that we purchased and added to the house to just give it a different um, entertainment for us and the kids. And we added these accent lights. They are solar powered, so they only come on at nighttime, of course. Come on in. So this is what they call a bar stool and a bar area. We don't drink, but that's what they call it. But actually for us, it's extra seating because of course, you know, we have a large family. And when we have get togethers, we'll have extra seating. So I found these beautiful leather bar stools here at Rooms To Go. They're very cushioning and soft. I love it. So I got two of these to fit here at this area here. I got these placemats at Kirkland's. They are like really cute. They look kind of like wicker. And then I found these napkin rings, of course, here at Kirkland's as well. I love them because they're springy, little brown beads, something so different, I love it. Found this little piece here at Burlington's Coke Factory. During the pandemic, like all of their stuff was like totally marked down to great price. So. I got a lot of things from there. I made these pictures, printed them out, and found some cute Dollar Tree frames. And here I have a burlap bow that I made, placed it there. I got the blessing from Burlington's as well and added our family portrait there to complete this look. I absolutely love it. Okay, now we're moving on to my formal dining room. I'm so in love with this dining room. We picked this out from Rooms To Go. Again, it's the gray leather. I decided to get something gray because it's neutral and I can put anything with it. But the colors I decided to use was the mint green and the soft pink, which is kind of rose gold. So I found the runner and the mats at Target, one of my favorite stores. And I finally found me some napkin rings and I got this these cups we got them from a dear friend of ours they gave us a housewarming gift when we moved in and we really appreciate them so I added them to the table as well I could not find any rose gold plates so what did I do I spray painted them I spray painted them rose gold to give me the look that I was looking for and I also found these little decorative balls here at Burlington's as well and I spray painted a couple of them rose gold I found these lights they're leaf lights and they're rose gold and they light up at night. I found those at Tuesday morning, I think is where I found those from. And I just decided to throw them in in the basket and mix it in and put a candle in the middle. I absolutely love this basket as well. It's so cute. I got this at Big Lots for $1.99. So cute. These curtains here I got from Big Lots as well. They're rose gold velvet. They're very soft and beautiful. I just absolutely love them. It completed my look. I already had these sheer curtains. Just added them in the middle to give it the final look. And again, we do have a TV mounted on the wall. So when our children and I 
or sitting here eating, we can watch TV together. So it's another classic look that my husband loves that because they love movies and they love watching TV together. So we've added those all around the house. These here are placemats, but I decided to put them on the wall and make them um, some accents on the wall to look like pictures. So that completed the look of the formal dining room. And also this set of four chairs came with the bench. And that's what I loved about this set because you can set more than one person on it and add it with the four chairs again because we have a large family and we had to have a lot of seating space and for if we have company over as well. And also I added this beautiful rose gold wallpaper that I found at Target. Absolutely beautiful. Um, we didn't want to do a lot of painting because you know it could be time consuming and a little pricey so we just decided to cut corners and buy some wallpaper. I added them to each side of the room just to make the room pop. Here is my humble kitchen. It's one of the downsides about the house because it's actually a small kitchen. But the thing that I do like about it is that it's in the middle of the house. And so everybody can connect where everybody's bedrooms are on each corner of the house. And like the kitchen is like the centerpiece of the home. Have our stainless steel microwave, stainless steel stove. I'm going to eventually get me a coffee area in my living room on the other side of my fireplace. But for right now, we have it here on the cabinets here. We had to go get a new refrigerator because the one that we purchased at home, it actually went out on us. We are thinking it was already gone out, but it was kind of rigged to make us think it was working. Vlogs coming soon on that. But we had to get a Whirlpool, more expensive than I wanted, but when you have to do what you have to do, that was the only ones that were left at the store because otherwise we would have had to order one and we didn't know when we would have gotten it back. And of course you need a refrigerator for your food, so. All right, so the cabinets I did on our other vlog, if you've watched it, how I did the granite top. Actually it was started out as a tan color, but I took some contact paper and placed it on here. It was a lot of work, but it was worth it because it made the kitchen look like it has granite tops and it doesn't and we kept it under budget. Also, the wallpaper looks like bricks, but they are not bricks. It is wallpaper as well. So we got both of those things from Lowe's and we placed it on here and made it look like it is real granite and bricks. I absolutely love my cabinets because they're the wood color um, thinking about painting them white, not sure, um, still trying to keep the budget down. Maybe later on that'll be another project that I'll do, but for right now it works. And I absolutely love my little kitchen. Also up here we have our family uh, picture that I found. It just kind of accented the kitchen as well. My towels, this is my happy place. I found those and black and white and I absolutely love those and I added to the look in the kitchen as well. These little roosters I thought were so adorable. They're salt and pepper shakers and I already had this little basket that kind of looks like the farmhouse look as well. We're thinking about adding some eggs in there and just making it really cute. I was going to go with the lemons theme, but that seems like everybody's doing the lemons theme. So I kind of went off on that look and just stick with the basic farmhouse look as well here. All right, so on to the next. Here is our laundry room found this picture at Burlington's again on the little sale they had going on double cabinets here um, use it for storage as well washer and dryer and also put the uh, wallpaper up there too to just complete the look and found this rug and placed it here so made the room very gray and white um, farmhouse look as well all right on to my rug As you can tell, my whole house is about 
a farmhouse. I said I wasn't going to do it, guys, but I ended up doing farmhouse throughout the whole house. Absolutely love this gray color. I wanted something neutral for my husband and I. So I found this at Big Lots and I thought it was perfect. This bench here is more storage. It's gray leather, it's so cute. This came with a little throw blanket. Absolutely finish off this look here in my room. Some of these pillows came with the set and the other pillow over there, the gray one, netted, it's so beautiful. I got that as Big Lots as well, but it did not come with the set. I found these little pictures here from Big Lots as well. Enjoy the little things. I love that. We're better together and to breathe. All of this thing was a, well, I should say it was not a farmhouse look for my room. Actually, my room was more of like a beach field. Um, we love going to the beach. We love hotels and just getting away. So this room reminded us of that. So here's my dresser. I have all my Serenity 7 jewelry here. I got this from Simply Unique Jewelry. I love this. I haven't worn it yet because I purchased it when I was pregnant. This little block here be a blessing. I hold a little bit of my jewelry as well. And this was my birthday turn up hat that I absolutely love that my daughter purchased for me prior. It wasn't for my birthday. Um, again, we have another TV mounted. Excuse the wires. I absolutely do not like wires, but this is my husband's game that he hooked up. But the people did everything wireless. We have this table here, very cute lamp added here with the candle from Bath and Body Works. He has his uh, books and stuff that he's studying and reading. And we had to bring this from the other house because my husband absolutely loves, like I said, the beach. And so this beach picture we brought from Colorado and he wanted it placed in the room somewhere. So again, the brown and gray and cream matched that perfectly. We got these here. I absolutely love them. They're like a sage green mint color um, from Burlington's as well. I absolutely love those curtains. And in here we have a walk-in closet. A lot, of, not a lot of space, but it's for me, baby Jay, and my husband. Um, we got this from the neighbor. It was actually free, so we picked that up. We purchased this to add some more space in the room and we have a top shelf there. I haven't had a chance to organize in here yet, but when I do, it's gonna look so cute. All right, come on, this is our bathroom. I love this bathroom, it's another feature of the house. It's light and bright, I absolutely love it. Um, we added our own new shower head in there because the one that we had, it was not what we wanted, so we wanted something big and the water can come out forcefully. This mirror was here already. I absolutely love it. And the lighting here is fantastic. We have the double sink, so it's his and her. So I love that. And he has his drawers, I have mine, and we have a cabinet space. Um, we got this, I believe, uh, Ross or Burlington's one. Um, I love the mauve color and the pink and the gray. And it actually goes with my bedroom set, so I absolutely love it. It kind of blends in. And also in my room, I'm going to be adding um, this pink color. What is it? Plush pink. I'm going to be adding that into my room as well um, in a different season. Also, we have another closet space here with shelving. So that was a bonus for this bathroom as well. Hold on to the moments that make us two. Also, we have Baby J here in the corner. He's taking a nap. This bed, this is one of the things that I had on my baby registry, and my family member purchased it for me. I was so happy because I wanted it. Um, I believe we got that at Walmart. Target, one of the two. I'm not sure, can't remember which one it was, but it was one of the two. And it's an um, awesome bassinet. It vibrates, it plays music, even though he doesn't like any of those things, but it's okay. So come along with me, and we're gonna show you the bathroom, which is the guest bathroom and the girls' bathroom. So again, beautiful mirror that was already here. We love it. It's a single sink. 
Got the cabinets there, candle burning. I love this color because it's still simple and cute. It's like a salmon pink, I guess, orange with the soft pink, kind of like the ocean as well. So we love this bathroom. It's just big enough for the guests and for our daughters. All right, so here we have Shania's room. Shania, you wanna give a little tour? Um, she wanted to go with the Paris theme because actually I had some things for my women's conference that I did the front of the year. So we just decided to just go ahead and just do Paris. And so we got a lot of different Paris things to add this room and make it pop with a lot of pink, gray, and white. All right, so the first thing we walk in, I created this little collage here. Um, I got these from Free Print, so if you like to order some prints, they're there. Um, then I got these lights that go all around my room. I got these from Amazon. Um, they literally go all around, and I like that I can go around my closet. My mom gave me that idea. Yes. And I actually liked it, so I did it. Then I got the side table from Ikea, and then along with it, I got a fixing diffuser, which I diffuse my essential oils. Um, so I got that. My Paris candle, which was also from my mom's conference. Um, then this is my bed, my beautiful queen size bed. This was originally China's, but I got it from her. So this is my bed, and then my bedding um, comforter was from my parents as well. Mm -hmm. um, they used it previously for um, the Valentine's Day season, so they let me have it. And I am absolutely in love with it. And then I also got my pillows pretty much from the set with the comforter. And my mom also got these from Big Lots, I believe, mm -hmm. the Lashes Pillow yeah. Cases. And then I got this um, pillowcase from Amazon. It says Lash Out. That one from Big Lots. And, you know, the rest is history. Mm -hmm. Then I got this wall decal. I think I got it from Home Depot. Yes. Yeah, that's where I got it from. Or Lowe's, one of those. It's Home Depot, I think. Okay. And then my dad got me this beautiful picture here from Burlington's. And then this is my hamper. Um, I got this one from Burlington's as well. My desk was my mom's. I love it. Thank you, mommy. <laughs> yes, it was my jewelry table. That's where I made all of my little finds. It was nowhere to place it in here except for here. So we gave it to her so she can do her online school here in her room. And again, there's another one of those Yay, chairs that I we love absolutely it. love. Then two of these bins came from Big Lots. I had a hard time finding them because they always sold out. Mm -hmm. And then I got this mannequin also from my mom's conference. Um, like I said, yes. she, in, she incorporated a lot of things in here. Yes. <laughs> and then she also bought me these decals from Big Lots, yes. which I really love. And then my entertaining center, TV. Then my little thing I got from Burlington. I have my books and stuff in here. My rug I got from Walmart. Mm -hmm. Then all that holds my um, remotes, essential oils, things like that. My closet, if you guys want to see a little peek of it. Um, I got the shoe thingy from Amazon. This organizer is from Target. Mm -hmm. I hung all my things up here. These are all my awards I won, sixth grade. Just wanna, I don't think I told you guys, but I got highest average in all subjects yes. and perfect attendance. <laughs> she did. So yeah, that's my closet, and I hope you guys enjoyed my part of the room tour. Yeah, it's beautiful. Okay, moving on to Shiloh's. <laughs> we can't forget this beautiful picture that I made for her. I adore pretty things and witty words. And we printed it out and found a dollar frame from the Dollar Tree. Yay, love it. All right, so we're in Shiloh's room. She's gonna be sharing with Joel later on, but right now this is her space. And she has her big, big Bobby house up. She got it uh, last year, a couple of years ago for Christmas. Here we have Shania's old bed, which is a, a bunk bed. We bought this from Kohl's online because she loves unicorns. So I thought that was so, very fitting for her. This is the toy, so I'm And we got her some buckets for her toys. Got so, pillows on her bed. So this is... And this up is, here we have wall decals, which is unicorns so cute we got those as, at Lowe's or Home Depot as well we got these little decals at the Dollar Tree because once I get his up we're gonna be doing um, the jungle theme with lions lions is his theme unicorns is her theme and we got this cute little pocket set I got at um, Target at the dollar spot 
Um, probably got it for about $3. This dream. The little um, clips. We printed this out. Dream Big Shiloh. This is her entertainment center and her TV. Oh, her closet. We have double doors here. I loved about this. This is her room. We had to store all of her toys up there so she won't keep tearing her room up. And that's baby Joel's blanket set that his godmother purchased for him. And we'll be putting that out once we get his bed up. And I found this cute um, drawer here for $20 at Big yeah. Lots. And she added all of her little things here. We have her dresses. Found these at what was that store called? We got the hangers from Home Goods. So they're super cute and girly with the little glitter on it. So this is Shiloh's room. All right, so we're headed to my oldest daughter's room. She has the luxury of having her own space yeah. up here. Hi everyone, so welcome to my room. So I'm just gonna show you a little bit of my room. <laughs> this is my TV, of course. I have this nice LED light strip that my dad got. Um, so it stays on yellow for my theme, which you're about to see here soon. Um, when you come over here, I have these shelvings I got from Home Goods. This I got from Burlington's. I got this from Big Lots. And my mom made this sign personalized for me with the Dollar Tree uh, frame. And come over here to my bed. My comforter I got from Amazon.com. My duvet cover and the cover that's actually inside. My pillow I got for my birthday from my neighbor. These pillows I got from Amazon as well. They were pillow covers and I stuffed them. Um, I got some end tables on both sides, very, uh, very cheap on Amazon. Very cheap on Amazon. I got this candle from TJ Maxx and it smells like pineapple. It smells so good, you guys. I love the smell of this. Got this cute little plant. I think I got this one from Big Lots. I got that one from Burlington's. And I got these really cute hexagon shapes. Uh, they're supposed to go on the wall. I gotta put this one up. I got these off Amazon as well. Super cute shelvings. Come over here to my other side. Um, I have a Scentsy warmer. It says be kind, super cute. And the scent to go with it is called Be My Honey. And it smells like honey. It smells like everything sweet. Honey, pineapple, I don't even know how to describe it. It's just a really good smell. I painted this myself. I got my sheets. Um, I gotta figure out from where, I gotta remember, but I will link that as well. Okay, over here I have my desk area. Got this desk from Amazon.com. I got my little seat covering for Amazon.com. And I got my white little bucket chair from Walmart.com. Okay, I got this cute lamp at Kirkland's. Love it, so cute, love the little glass bottom. And I got this cute picture from Big Lots as well. So my three main stores would be Amazon.com is definitely top, BitLots, and Burlington's, yeah. So that is my room tour, I hope you enjoyed. All right guys, so that was the grandeur tour of our home, I hope you enjoyed it. If you're new here, please go ahead and hit the like and subscribe button, we'd love to see you back here. Hit the bell for the notification so you'll know when we're posting our next post. Until next time, we'll see you then. Bye-bye.